how narcissists test you. When a narcissist is targeting you, they will test you to see if you are a suitable source of supply for them. They will undergo a procedure intended to establish the quality of the supply. They will test your performance and reliability. They will put you to the test. They will conduct a secret examination, observation and evaluation to determine your qualities and characteristics. To see if you are an empathetic person. To see if you are going to be a suitable target for them to invade and exploit. When you meet someone new, it's normal to want to get to know them. It's normal to want to learn more about them. But the narcissist just wants to know what type of person you are so they can use it to their advantage. So that they can determine what type of supply you are going to be for them. From the moment you meet them, they are conducting a test on you that you are unaware of. That you don't know you are participating in. But they disguise it as though they're just getting to know you. As though they're just trying to learn more about you. The reason why narcissists test you is because they're looking for very specific qualities and characteristics. They're looking for people who have some form of power or influence. People who have money. People who are passionate and creative. But above all, they are looking for people who have lots of empathy. Narcissists seek out empaths, people who are kind, caring and giving, but they see your kindness as a weakness, they see it as something that they can exploit. Narcissists are also looking for people who display some form of vulnerability. People who are able to be easily hurt, influenced or attacked. People who have been abused in the past. People who have been bullied. People who have issues with their family. People who have narcissistic exes. They're targeting people who have experienced all of this so that it's less effort for them to exploit you. But also so that when you start to figure them out, they can turn it all around on you and say that you are a broken person who has problems with everyone. You come from a broken home and you've had issues with your exes. So that they can portray you as a difficult or bad person in the relationship. As though you are the cause of all of the problems. When they specifically targeted you because you have been abused in the past. Because you have issues with your family or narcissistic exes. But they will say that they were trying to help you. Or that you didn't tell them the whole story. They will always find a way to turn everything on you. Because that's why they targeted you in the first place. They targeted you because they knew that they would be able to do this to you. That's the reason why they don't target people who they know are just going to put them in their place. 
people who are not going to tolerate their behaviour. From the moment they meet you, they are testing you to see if you have these qualities and characteristics, to see if you're going to put up with it, to see if they can get away with the things that they do to you. They're testing you to see if you're a people pleaser, to see if you're the type of person who tries hard to make other people happy, to see if you're willing to neglect your own needs or desires to see if you're willing to take the blame for things that have nothing to do with you. Because that's going to be a good source of supply for the narcissist. It tells them that you're going to be easy to control. It's going to be easy for them to make you do what they want. You've already been in bad relationships. So that's something they can use against you. They can use it to turn the tables on you and blame you for your own abuse. Maybe you don't have many friends. Maybe you can't depend on your parents. So you don't have any support. There's no one that you can run to. There's no one to tell you that this is abuse. So now they don't even have to isolate you. You're an easy target for the narcissist. You're like a sitting duck. It doesn't take much work for them to break you down. Because you haven't had much support in the past and you've got no one there to validate your current situation. Narcissists test you to see if you are someone that they can depend on for emotional support and financial support. They need someone that they can depend on for attention, money and sex. They need someone to listen to their monologues. Someone that they can use as their emotional tampon. Someone that they can control. They're looking for someone that they can depend on. Someone with a good job. Someone who makes plenty of money. Someone who has a car. Someone who is willing to help them. And they know that empathic people want to help. They want everything to be perfect. And the narcissist takes advantage of your good nature because they see it as a weakness. They see it as something that they can exploit. They're looking for someone to take responsibility for their lives, for their health and emotional state, for their financial situation. Someone who will take responsibility for their actions and for where they are in life. Narcissists are not willing to take responsibility for themselves. So they target people who are willing to do that. They're looking for people who are willing to admit their own mistakes. But they also want people who will take responsibility for what they do. They're looking for someone who they can blame for everything. But they are also looking for intelligent, dynamic people. People who are focused. People who are self-motivated. People who don't need any support. But then they are also looking for someone who doubts their worth. Someone who has been made to believe they're not enough. Because this is another thing that the narcissist can take advantage of. It's another thing that they can use to their benefit. They target people who have been abused. People who may believe that they deserve to be mistreated. People who don't realise their worth. People who don't realise that they deserve more. Because that's how they keep you down. 
That's how they keep you thinking that this is okay. As though you deserve to be treated this way. Based on how other people have treated you in the past. But it's also very effective when they target you. Because it's like you finally met someone who does see your worth. Someone who values you for who you are. When really, it's just manipulation. They don't see your worth as a human being. They just see you as an object that exists to meet their needs. Narcissists test you. When they target you, they're looking for these very specific qualities and characteristics. And they can determine these things very quickly and effortlessly. They're predators. They're looking for vulnerable people. They're looking for people with low self-esteem. And it's like they have a sixth sense. They know who is going to be a suitable target for their manipulation. They know who they're going to be able to take advantage of. If you seem too confident and sure of yourself, they're not even going to bother with you. They want someone that they can control. They do not want someone who is going to control them. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.